goodbye to Quest. I'm finally going home. So I finally get to move home, go home. I'm, I'm so excited. I've been here at the Quest almost a year. Not quite a year, but almost a year. One day off a year. So I arrived at the Quest on February 12th, 2019. I'm leaving this year, February 11th, 2020. <laughs> so one day off a year. I have to say it's been a big year. My first year out of hospital in a wheelchair and everyone here at Quest has been so kind, so thoughtful, so friendly. They've just, they've helped make it feel like home and I can't thank them enough. They've made, made this whole, whole thing so much easier. So thank you, thank you Quest Bandura. So being here almost a year, I have made a home for myself here at the Quest. I've got so much stuff here set up in set up exactly where I want it so it's gonna be a lot to pack up so I'm gonna show you around and show you how I have it set up so I'll start with my bedroom which is through here so this is my bedroom and I got this desk from home and it's got my computer on it which I edit all my videos on. I have a cheerleading trophy sitting back there too. And over here I have my unicorn, which has my cheer bow and cheer medal <laughs> that I got from competition. And then over here I pin up the goals that I've achieved because I said it in another video, which I'll put a link in the description about how I set goals. And one of them, in the video I said, I talked about this and I put my goals in here and then once I achieve them, I put them up there. And then over here is my bed. So the Quest um, were happy to take out their bed and let me put in uh, a bed that suits my disability and yeah so they're really nice about it and even up here I'm thinking what are those weird things sitting up there they are little miniature things you get from the supermarket and different people are helping me collect them <laughs> even some of the quest staff give me some yeah, I, I've got a lot of them. I even have another cheerleading trophy just there. All right, that's my bedroom. I'll show you the rest of the apartment. So through here is the dining area and the kitchen. But right, here's the dining table. I've got sheets folded up to help lift the table up so I can fit under it. You might have noticed that's where I film a lot of my videos. So, yep, right there. Sit up here. And go to the camera. And then, through down there is the kitchen. This way is the lounge room. So this is the lounge room. Oh, and just here, this whiteboard is what well, I write down what I've got planned for the day, so, so I know and stuff. And as you can see, 10 a.m. Film, filming, which I'm a bit late with that today, but then I'm 6 p.m. I'm going out with friends, which I'm going out in the city for the first time since I've been in a wheelchair. So I'm pretty, 
pretty excited, which is why I'm I'm kind of halfway through getting ready, so that's why I'm wearing wearing this dress. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm getting ready to go out. But I'm gonna film this video first. <laughs> and then through here. So yeah, I watch Netflix with my family sometimes on the TV here. I've got my another cheerleading trophy from Nationals, the big one over there. And then I have all my camera equipment and things on the desk right here. And a lot of it was taken home already, but I have some of it here. Right here is the little trophy that I got when I was at the Royal Talbot, which is a spinal rehab. We, we made a little film <laughs> and I got given this because I was the director <laughs> for the best director. <laughs> this will have been my home for 364 days. So I've accumulated a lot of stuff. <laughs> so the next few days I have to pack it all up and get ready for the move. So to say thank you to the staff at Place Mandura, I am going to make my mum's famous deadly chocolate cake. It's a really yummy cake. I hope they like it. I hope they enjoy this cake because I've made it with a lot of love because I love how awesome they are. They're so friendly, they've been there for me and I can't thank them enough. So. I hope they'll know how grateful I am from this cake that I make them, this delicious cake. Well, I hope it's a delicious cake. <laughs> now it's up to the best part, licking the bowl. So now it's time for me to ice the cake. Got some chocolate icing right here. I'm going to put some M&Ms on it. not exactly a pretty cake but it's a cake made with love <laughs> yeah <laughs> so the cake is supposed to say thank you love M it's supposed to say that <laughs> uh. all of them are amazing and I'm going to miss them so much one even said she was going to tie me up and not let me leave, but I told them I'll go back and visit them one day. Thank you guys, you're the best. So I'm finally home. Last night I spent my first night living at home and it was great. And today is actually my one year anniversary of leaving the Royal Talbot, which is the hospital I was at. So that time goes by quickly. <laughs> so I still have things left to organize and figure out where I want to put stuff, but this is where I'll be in my videos now. This is, this is home. Quest rooms no longer. <laughs> and if you want to stay updated on all my Euro adventures, Remember to subscribe and if you're excited for what's happening, click that like button and at the end of the week, I might be going to visit my old high school I went to. So there might be a video on that 